there is a change of paradigm going on. And computer science is moving from what we call the programmable era, where engineers used to code their own programs and uh, give instruction to machines to do what they want, to a cognitive era, where machines are supposed to learn from the interaction with the humans the abilities and the uh, way to encode a program in the machine is through machine learning. So the new type of jobs are not going to be only in the engineering side of the equation, but it will be also in the giving instruction to the machines to do what we want. And this type of instruction are going to be given by professional, by humanists, by people that are able to t teach the computer to do some particular task. For example, they can teach the computer to translate from one language to the other. They can teach the computer to uh, do some type of diagnosis if they are doctors. So, so there will be a new marketplace for instructors of computers that doesn't exist today. And it will be, in my opinion, the place where many of the people now studying humanities will find new jobs. And because the industrial revolution is huge, we are talking about 20% of the workforce will be affected in a way or the other, there's going to be a huge uh, interest in finding this type of skills. And uh, I believe that's going to be the massive uh, turnaround. And in summary, in short, it's not going to be just for engineers. Computer science and artificial intelligence will be an opportunity also for people coming from humanities and from other jobs, from other, let's say, domains to tell the machines what to do.